and it's now time to cue the titles. Here we go. Oh yes, Dooley the Ting Ting. Only fought you over cause you let him Girl, I guess he didn't know any better Girl, that man didn't show me ever Do all I can just to show you it's special Certain it's your love that holds me together Lately you say he been killing the vibe Hello and welcome to Snazzy Variety 90 I'm Snazzy and this is Snazzy's Important Stuff And today we're talking about the concept of strength versus weakness And as you may know They both have different kinds of forms Forms that can be identified against each other. And when people say to you, what are your strengths and what are your weaknesses? They can be a list of two different categories, which we can be weighed out against each other. And each time, as many people say, strength wins out. It wins out because obviously people look at how People discover what it means to be strong in yourself. But being strong in yourself doesn't mean necessarily you win the next battle. The next battle of feeling that you are mighty, strong and powerful. It can mean many different things, many different reasons, many different whys, many different wheres. But yet, what I'm saying to you today is, sometimes when you have a weakness, it can also be your strength. It can also be your strength to help you gain what you have lost. Lost to what you have gained. To enable to become more of a stronger person than you may or may not have been. And yet people go to and say, can you be strong again? Can you use the weakness that inside of you to become strong again? And the answer is yes. Because you can be strong again by your weakness. Because your weakness can be also your strength. So it can be both parties as mutual as each other. Say for example on Facebook you have mutual friends. People that you know are the same people linked to each other. Strength and weakness are linked to each other. And always remain linked. Years upon years upon years down the line. Will always remain a link. A link down the line. A link in the future. A link in the past. But you never know. A link could be anything. And that is why a strength versus weakness. Is always just a link. And that is why I'm telling you today. Don't think about it as a enemy. Or an angel. Think about it as link between the two. Grateful and gratefulness. Sad and sadfulness. Being human and not being human. These can remain be a link. Be a link of who and how you want to be and why you want to be it. Also, I am going to be telling you this in advance, so please do not worry. The Friday shout out show is going to be a double. So the first show is going to be for Aaron James, which will happen at 10pm. And I'm also going to be hosting a second one for 11pm. Which is obviously, I'm going to put question marks on that because obviously the person who I've spoken to knows who that is. But it will be revealed later this week. So that is it for today's episode of Snazzy's Important Stuff. We'll be back in the next episode where there'll be more fun, more frolics and more important stuff. Up next will be Top Topics, which will be tomorrow at 9pm. Until next time, this is me, Snazzy, giving you the flip side of important stuff. Signing off. Goodbye for now. Ting ting. Peace out. Let me see you go